Handicapping the Arc de Triomphe, let's delve into the contenders for this year's Arc de Triomphe, analyzing their strengths and potential for victory. Continuous, the Saint Liga winner, who has recently been supplemented for the Arc. This three-year-old sensation has taken a remarkable leap forward in the latter part of this season. Although he previously finished eighth in France, trailing behind Ace Impact in the 10.5 furlong group, one pre du jockey club, Continuous has truly shone over longer distances. His victories in the mile and a half group two great voltageur and the subsequent 14.5 furlong Saint Liga showcase his prowess. What sets Continuous apart is his adaptability to both firm and soft ground, along with the advantageous weight allowance for three-year-olds. These attributes make him a formidable challenger to the ARC favorites. Speaking of favorites, Ace Impact, Jean-Claude Rouget's three-year-old cracksman colt, is a force to be reckoned with. Debuting this year, he has won all five of his starts, including the Group 1 Prix du Jockey Club at Chantilly by an impressive three and a half lengths. Ace Impact's versatility on various ground conditions and draw positions make him a strong contender. However, Ace Impact faces two uncertainties in this race. Firstly, he'll be up against older horses for the first time, but the weight for age allowance works in his favor. Secondly, he'll be tackling the mile and a half distance for the first time. Fortunately, his sire, Cracksman, excelled at this distance in top-level races, offering hope for his ability to stay the extra two furlongs. Pukum, the six-year-old, has steadily climbed into Group 1 company over the past few years. His triumphs in the Group 1 Coronation Cup and the Group 1 King George VI this summer demonstrate his prowess on good to soft ground. With ample qualification for the distance and a liking for soft going, Pukum appears ready to deliver a textbook performance. His experience and ability to withstand younger challenges bode well for his chances. Ralph Beckett's consistent performer, Westover, boasts a record of rarely finishing outside the top three in 12 starts. His versatility on different ground types and consistent mile-and-a-half outings in group, one races make him a strong candidate. A favorable inside draw could further bolster his chances, especially after his narrow loss to Hookham in the King George VI. Another three-year-old, Feed the Flame, has showcased remarkable consistency this season. While he trailed behind Ace Impact in the Prix du Jockey Club, he rebounded with a victory in the Group 1 Grand Prix de Paris. His recent second-place finish in the Group 2 Prix Neil proves his quality and adaptability. Now, being proven over the distance and versatile on any ground, Feed the Flame is poised to be in contention. After meticulous analysis, our choice for the Arc de Triomphe is continuous, the Saint Liga winner, recently supplemented. Although he faced a significant defeat by Ace Impact in June, Continuous has evolved since then, and Aidan O'Brien aims to cap off his historic year with victory in this prestigious race.